God bless you, Bishop Wooden here. Pray that you're, you're doing well today. Pray that things are going well for you and that you're blessed of the Lord and highly favored. These are some exciting times in which we are living in. And I'm telling you, I'm glad to be saved. I'm glad to be a Christian. I'm glad to know the Lord Jesus in a day like today. Praise the Lord. Now, tonight we're going back to the teachings on the peacemakers. Yes, I've been talking about peacemakers, and I think this will be my third sermon on the subject. And uh, uh, God has some things to say to us about this issue. You know, as I said before, the, uh, the Beatitudes are progressive. And there is no way that one could be a peacemaker, can be a peacemaker in Christ without first being pure of heart. And after being pure of heart, then we've got to be people who mourn for our own sin and the sins of others and so forth and so on. The meek and that we go to hunger and thirst after righteousness. We've got to be the merciful. And now we're talking about being peacemakers. People who, because we receive peace from the Lord, now we take that peace and we give it to others. And so tonight, I'm going to talk about how uh, our Lord Jesus, not only was he a peacemaker, but he was also a troublemaker. Amen. Uh, and so to, to be a peacemaker, sometimes war has got to be uh, made. But how we carry out that war is very, very important. So I want you to join me tonight. We're going to study the Bible together. We're going to walk in the scriptures. And we, my friends, are going to make peace in the name of our Lord. God bless you. I'll see you tonight.